quieting down. As it warms up, it's quieting down. This is, if I'm to guess, this is a Z06 with a Z07 optioned to the wall. You got the aero kit on the front, which is part of the Z07 option. You got the carbon fiber. You have to buy the Z07 option to get uh, to be able to buy the, the uh, carbon fiber wheels, but there are the carbon fiber wheels in all their glory. There it is, and of course, the signature, the big wing on the back. She's a beauty. Car's about 3.6 inches wider than the current C8 Corvette. And the reason that the car is wider are two things. Number one is that the opening is wider for cooling, okay? And number two, the wheels are bigger. So the 3.6 inches increased width is due to the wheels and the cooling that you can see right in there. Absolutely beautiful. Great view of the car here today. Carbon, carbon fiber, everything. Stitching, beautiful yellow stitching. Z06 right here on the, on the uh, center. You can see the Z06 there. Also, if you look right here, Z06 right here on the door hinge. Where else? And of course, right here on the side of the car. So we got three different places just for openers where the Z06 is. And of course, on the beautiful carbon fiber wheels, there's a Corvette signature right there to let you know that these wheels are Corvette. And also, you'll see down here, it says on the calipers, carbon ceramic. So those are part of the package of the Z07 package that comes with a when you purchase a CO7 package. This has got everything on it. It's loaded. <laughs> I don't think they left anything off in the check sheet when they built this car. And I think we've got cup two tires. 
So this, they must have another... Cup 2 tires right there on the side. So that's all part of the Z07 package. This, the aero package, the wing, and you buy, if you buy the Z07 package, then you have the option to buy the carbon fiber wheels. You cannot get these carbon fiber wheels unless you buy the Z07 option. So this car is all the money. <laughs> Since they haven't announced yet what the prices of this car, which would be nice, but they haven't yet. But if you were to get the price of this car, it's going to be a lot. <laughs> a lot more than a C8, I'll tell you that. Notice uh, on the front, this is the first time, I think, in any Z06 that I can remember that they've uh, changed this, the shape of the front end. Usually the front end stays the same, but in this particular case, you'll see that this, this opening here is much bigger for cooling. All of this is about cooling. And if you remember, the C7 Z06 was a pain in the butt. I had one, and a cooling was a problem. I did a want to go fast event, a half mile event, and my car overheated and was a problem. In fact, I ended up taking myself out of the competition because of the overheating problem. Well, I'll tell you right now, if you look at what's going on here in the front, I think we got proper cooling now. And with the with this um, winglet out front here and this package you see right here and the wing in the back and also uh, underneath here, I don't know if I can get a shot of this. I gotta lay down on the ground to do this. Let me see if, let me see if I can do this. <laughs> there are little winglets supposedly down here. No, I don't see them. Oh, there they, I think that's, I think that's them down there. Uh, they're, little, they're little winglets. They might not have them on this car, but there are. There are, there are little winglets on the bottom of the car to help for aerodynamics. And I think this car has um, about 700 some odd pounds of downforce on the car. Okay, we're here with Rick, who's the general sales manager here at Naha Chevrolet, and he's the guy that's responsible for bringing this wonderful event here to Neha Chevrolet, and I really appreciate it. I know all the Corvette fans really appreciate it, what you've done. I think it's a great thing, but give us a little idea. How, do you, how does one go about doing this? Well, um, it's set up through GM, and it's based on uh, your, your Corvette sales, if you qualify or not, and then there's only so many shows that they can do, and uh, you gotta tell them pretty quick and early into the process that you're interested in doing that, and uh, you pay the fee and you bring it here, and as you can see, it's a, it's a process setting it up and uh, should be a fun day for everybody.
got to hit the center. I can feel the ground trembling under me. How about that? Oh yeah, I can feel it in my feet. <laughs> I can feel it in my feet, that's pretty wild. It's a great view, great shot of the engine, I love this. Watch this, watch this on the engine, wow. That looks terrific. Yes, sir. I like that. Next. <laughs> now let's go and look at the seats, and I'll tell you which seat I like. I like the GD2 seat, and I'll tell you. I'd like the GD2 seat, and I'll tell you why. See these right here and right here. Um, they're easy to get in, easy to get in and out of the car. But let's go over and look at this sport competition sport seat. The idea is to hold you in. Look at the size of these side bolsters. Getting in and out of the car is going to be eventful. I think getting in and out of the car is going to be eventful. That's the best way I can say it. Now, you can go over here and you can scan and make this your own. You can scan the QR code and uh, build your own Z06. Pretty nice. Right there. We're going to walk over here. Let's take a look at what's going on over here. Here's the car on display, which I love. This is nice. And uh, here's the, the two types of tires you can get. Of course, the cup tires. That's if you're really racing, you want the cup tires. But here's the thing about the cup tires. They probably, if you're doing track days with them, might last three or 4,000 miles, maybe. I mean, you're going to be tire poor. <laughs> Not good when it rains in Florida. Uh, when it rains, yeah, that's another good point, George. When it rains, uh, it's not going to be fun. So this is the tire you want. This is the tire. And notice two things I noticed about these tires that are interesting. There must be an inside and an outside because look at this tread over here. Notice the tread on the left-hand side edge and the tread on the right side edge. It looks like two different treads to me. And then over here, same thing with this. Look at the treads on this one, uh, on the outside and the inside, on the left side and the right side. It looks like there's two different styles going. So there's got to be an inside and an outside to these tires. Now, up here. Yeah, yeah, those look alike, don't they? No. No? This one stops. Oh, yeah, it stops. And this one, yep. And by the way, these cup tires are not cheap. <laughs> okay, wheels. I like what I see, wheels. Well, let's go to the carbon fiber first. That's beautiful. And here's a painted carbon fiber. And then over here, I like the new colors. This is my machine faced on the right. And on the left here is titanium satin. Boy, that looks nice, huh? And then down here we have a satin graphic on the left. Boy, that looks good. Boy, I'm looking at my at my uh, viewing screen here, and that looks really nice. And then over here, we have the black. And boy, does that look nice, too. Yeah, I think so. I mean, either one of those. These two rims look really, really nice. And I mean, the gray looks nice up here, and so does the uh, machine face. Yeah, isn't that nice? Then over here we have all the colors. Right here we have the 70th anniversary, two cars. One is uh, carbon flash metallic, the other one is pearl white. If you want a 70th anniversary car, C8. I don't know if they're going to make this in the Z06 or not. I'll ask around and find out. I think they are. Are they, George? It's only going to be in Z06. It's only going to be in Z06? Yep. Oh, okay. There you go. Over here we have all the colors. The new one I see is that caffeine metallic. That's, that's nice, isn't it? A lot of other colors. I think uh, all the others are carryovers from 22, this 21. This that's the, the new Nordic, color, right? That replaced the Nordic bronze. 
That, that replaced the what? Nordic bronze. The Nordic bronze. One, okay. One year. Caffeine is the replacement for the Nordic bronze. Look at these calipers. I, uh, let me put my hand up here. Um, these calipers. <laughs> these calipers are huge. Huge. <laughs> and notice uh, also that um, if you get carbon ceramic brakes, that says uh, Brembo carbon ceramic on the outside. Here's a regular one that doesn't say it. And here's the one over here if you do get the carbon ceramic brakes. Same thing over here. Um, very, very nice. Now over here, this is the carbon fiber for the engine cover. And here's the carbon fiber steering wheel. I don't, that doesn't do it for me. But I like the Z06 on the bottom. Of that. So there you have it, an epic display at Naha Chevrolet in Wildwood. Florida, right just outside the villages here in Florida. I uh, hope you like the video. Subscribe uh, if you want to keep up with what's going on here with our videos. And if you like the video, hit the like button and leave a comment. We always read all of the comments. So uh, take a minute and do that. Um, also, we have a meet and greet, C8 Corvette meet and greet coming up this Saturday, the 26th from 9 to 11 in the morning at Brownwood Paddock Square in the villages. And if you're nearby, come on over and join us. We have a ceramic coating display going on. Um, if you want to know anything about ceramic coating, one of the best guys from the Ocala area is going to be at this meet and greet. Come down and join us. So thanks again, and we'll see you uh, on the next video.